Very positively, Jax, now a Friday night football story unlike any other tonight. Just before the game between First Coast High School and Atlantic Coast High, a woman battling cancer was honored by players and coaches on both teams. News for Jax reporter Eric Avanye has this feel-good story from the 50-yard line. Her name is Milani McKee. She's a 31-year-old sister of the Atlantic Coast High School football coach Mike Montemayor. She's also the wife of a Fernandina Beach firefighter who joined her on the football field. Milani and her husband were both told she would never be able to have children. Then all of a sudden, she got pregnant naturally. But 17 weeks into her pregnancy, she was diagnosed with stage 4 stomach cancer. Despite the grim diagnosis, she recently gave birth to Tyler Monty McKee. And tonight was the first time little Tyler got to attend a football game coached by his uncle. So right before the start of the game, Milani was escorted out onto the football field where she was honored by both teams and people in the stands. She was honored for her continued fight against cancer. All the coaches on both teams wore shirts with her name on it. Prior to the ceremony, she had no idea this had been planned. We pulled up and there was a guy wearing the shirt actually. I was like, oh, I want one. And he wouldn't, he didn't even tell us about Anything going on here, it was a complete surprise and we're very blessed. How hard was it to keep this a secret? Pretty hard. <laughs> yeah, she rolled up and saw somebody with her name on it and said, Milani Strong, and she said she wanted that shirt. And I said, you are Milani. The coach of the First Coast High School football team says he was using this moment to teach his players about life off the field and what it truly means to be strong in the face of adversity. Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station.